Moya Jackson is in Spain, but the distance doesn't keep her from voicing her opinion about why the usually reclusive Michael has suddenly become so visible. I think it's a far more calculated reason. That's just my personal opinion. Yeah. By knowing the individual himself, I know that uh, Michael, there's been a time in his life that he would never grant an interview with anyone. There's an audience that he's lost, and I think he's trying to recapture that and regain that, and that's why he's, he's a bit more visible these days. Even with these latest appearances, LaToya believes Michael's guard is still up, and he'll be selective about what he reveals. It's something that he's very unhappy with, something that he's hiding from. I think coming from a dysfunctional family has a lot to do with it. I also think that people should try and accept him for his music and his talent and his ability and not for what he's done physically with himself. Bubbles. He doesn't want to look anything like my father. There's a lot they don't know and that could be one of the reasons why he's doing this. According to LaToya, their father Joseph continues to be a dark presence in their lives. He used to play this game with me all the time and say, LaToya, tell me the truth. If Joseph died, would you care? Would you cry? And I would say, why would you say that, would you? He goes, you answer first. I go, no, you answer. He says, no, I could care less. I wouldn't cry. I wouldn't miss him at all. LaToya says since the release of her tell-all autobiography, her relationship with her parents remains strained. However, she loves her sisters and brothers. It's um, basically the same as it was before with my parents. It's, it's the same situation with the mother saying, Oh, we love you. Please come home. Please call. Mm -hmm. Then, of course, you make that phone call, and she hangs the phone up. So it's no different. It's basically the same. As far as the siblings are concerned, I think the public has been misconceived. I think they think that there's a lot of rivalry there, and there isn't. Everything's fine. Michael's 90-minute talk with Oprah tonight probably sparked as many new questions about the family as it answered. No doubt the Jackson family saga will continue.